Hey there friends and welcome back to Strange Rebel Gaming, I'm Brianna White and today we'll be playing through the next part of Life is Strange 2, Episode 3. So many feels, so many emotions in so little time, that's what Life is Strange does and I hate it but I love it at the same time. Take a second before we begin to hit the like button as I give a shout out to our patron of the day, Matthew. Matthew, thank you so much for supporting me on Patreon, it really really means the world to me. Patreon has enabled studio upgrades and content upgrades and for me to hire an editor and all of these wonderful things are all possible thanks to you and your contribution on Patreon. Thank you so, so much. You are the best. Simply the best with Gusto. And now everyone, let's get on to that gameplay video. Enjoy. So I know it's on my task list to restock water for the kitchen and the shower. It's nicer here than other places we saw. Oh, I can Too inspect Penny's tent now. Homeless. What does Penny's tent sometimes. have inside? No home. A bong? Yeah, Classic. You're what in Humboldt County. These guys know how to make a bong out of pretty much anything. So much Stoners fun. always do. <laughs> no, I do too. What is that? Like a tree branch with a beer can mouthpiece? And now I do too. Interesting. Shit. Guess Penny's looking for somebody. Oh no. That sucks. Arthur Jinx Lee, last seen on Blue Side Creek, Humboldt, July 3rd, 2015. So this is a year ago. Two years ago, because now it's February 2017. He needs medical care. Any info, please contact Penny or the local police. Oh. Has anyone seen my face? Yeah, it seems like a Penny thing. Aw, they look so cute here. Oh. I love how they're like a real family. Wonder if they'd give me a cool nickname if I stayed here. His name is Baptist Dean Mikael, Michael? Michael? M Mikael, I don't know. Eyes, bro. Beautiful eye color, bro. Nice to have a dog around again. Oh, dog toy. Still mushroom. Oh, mushroom. <sighs> I've never been so sad at anything in my whole life. Not everybody has time to fucking recycle or compost their shit, especially when you live off the grid. We all should try. It's everybody's planet too. We try Almost done. We only have one Easy time. money, they said. The yeah, right. Need two more hands, Dishmaster? Uh, yeah. yeah. That'd be cool. I'm on it. I'm on the fence yeah. if point. the two conversations the going and at the same time at all like... times is annoying or good ambiance. I really can't tell because I'm I like want to listen to everything at the same time Finally. but if it's not important then maybe it's just kind of cool ambiance I don't know need a hand with your own chores that'd be awesome I need help moving the water tanks to the shower and kitchen okay I'll wait for you near the water tank so we can take on those barrels thanks Daniel I actually never helped him with the dishes back in Seattle we're all but everything's in this different now. together. Now you're here sponging off us trash on an illegal pot farm with a tourist visa lecturing us. Funny, right? Hannah, I'm sorry. We were not trying to lecture you. We are grateful we found that job and that you let us stay in the camp with you guys. I know. We're cool. Do you hate us now? You're funny. Don't worry. You'd know if I hated you. All I care about is my family right here. These three gutter punks. The rest, none of my business. Maybe Daniel can help me lift those tanks. Anna, you oh, kind yeah. of are just very abrasive and you argue with everyone. Wait, why can't I sit anymore? I lost my chance to sit? What? I was waiting to sit. Sometimes this game makes it so hard. Hi. 
I'm done with these potatoes. But thanks for nothing. Sorry, Hannah. Whatever. She's always like picking a fight! Tourists. Like those kids who come through here all psyched, and they have to bust ass, and they're gone. Like, I have a fucking choice. What am I supposed to do? Maybe you chose this life, but I didn't. We're I know. just talking yeah. about this. We all got scars of our own. I just fucking hate phonies. Too many here. Crusty backpack doesn't make you one of us. Well, what do I gotta do to pass initiation? Don't be a pussy. Stand up for us. You can't be part of our family unless you open up. This is a family too, not a pit stop. Out in the wild, sharing is caring. I hear you, but my brother comes first, always. That's good, shows you're not a selfish prick. Got way too many. <laughs> I'm like reading through the options and I'm like, what brought you here? How'd you meet the others? Liking this life? Leave! Honestly, she's mean enough that I just want to leave. I She's so mean. You don't have to tell me, but how did you end up on the road? Same old story. Fucked up family dysfunction. I just knew I had to get the fuck out before that curse can get me too. I'm glad you're at peace now. So, how did you hook up with the others? The usual way. Just bumming around. Hooked up with Finn first, then Cassidy, then Pennywise. Now we're all pretty fucking tight. Hell yeah, you are. It's awesome. So, are you satisfied with your life now? I'm grateful for what I have, yeah. Not everything is perfect, but we got balance, prospects. That's way more than I had before. Thanks for taking the time to talk, Hannah. That's cool. Yeah. Anyway, I didn't mean to grill you, Sean. It was a long day. Is she like Whoa. twitchy on purpose? Hannah's tough to figure out. Don't fuck with her. Weird. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, we did that, did that. Did redwood. Penny's tent. There's the water tanks. We went through this I was area. really in the zone today. Hope that'll pay. Oh, I think I will miss it here. Same. But we can't resist the wanderlust. Plus, Portland's waiting for us. I think I'll take a nap. Me too. I'm exhausted after today. In a week or two, we'll have enough to buy our way through the border. Why do I just have this, like, terrible feeling that all of the money he's made is gonna get stolen? Like, I just have this terrible feeling. Pick up a loan. What? I can pick I them up myself or I can me. ask him to lift them? Hmm. I feel uh I feel like asking him to lift them here is like literally the opposite of everything we did in episode 2. But I also feel like we really regretted that. But we also promised that we would go down to the lake and help him train. So if we actually go through with that, then in theory we don't need to help him use his powers here. I don't know. This game always makes me punished for everything that I choose. Gonna make me spam it. 
Just kill me now. <sighs> Let's get these over to the kitchen and shower. One step at a time, Sean. Thank you, Ingrid. I'm gonna miss this when we're gone. Where are the showers? All of this. Over there, right? An old tarp? What does this old tarp have to do with anything? Those guys sure know how to live outdoors. They've taught me so much already. Squirrels? Oh, no, they're talking about the tarp. Okay. I get it now. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, squirrels know how to live outdoors. But no, they're talking about Cassidy and, and Finn know how to live outdoors, so they know to use a tarp. It's different. Let's carry that one to the shower. I feel like I we we did we did a branch thing weirdly. Like there was no ability to be like Hey, you can help us out, Daniel, without using your powers. Like, there was no option or even, like, Daniel was like, do you want help with your chores? And Sean was like, yeah. And Daniel was like, okay, meet you by the showers. And then, or meet you by the water tanks. And then, like, there was no conversation if you chose to do it yourself. I feel like that's weird. Meet Daniel at the lake for his training. Okay. Well, hopefully then we can follow through on that promise. This is the wrong way, isn't it? Daniel's waiting for me. I should go meet him. Wrong direction. Camp has me a little turned around, but I'll figure it out. Just slowly walking through the forest. It would be so beautiful if we didn't have to be here. You know? It's a very long, silent walk we're taking. There's not even any music, so... <laughs> Feels a little weird. Sweet. But can you do it without your power? Oh yeah. I can do better with my own skills now. Next level. Onward. Ready to rumble? I am so ready. Let's start with our team how. T.S. Lobos. Ow, ow, ow. We still sound okay. Now, let's do this. Come on. Hold up. Too many people over there. Let's hit the other side. Just wanna really quickly do a quick lap of this little area for anything I might miss. Not looking like much here. Hey, can you move that tree trunk? Duh. That's 
Pretty big, Daniel. Damn, you know what you're doing. Hey! <laughs> Your face! Come on, I wasn't gonna drop I it on you. I hate pranks. Very funny, man. Okay, let's have some fun. We're out of sight here. Good. Should be safe. Should be until someone walks in and shows up. Guarantee that's what the life of strange does. Penny said it gets crazy crowded. People everywhere. Yeah. That's why we can train out here now. No people. Hmm. Let's try this. I want you to focus on these ugly mushrooms and blow them apart. Dude, it's toast. I'm waiting. Or maybe you... What the? Okay, a little <laughs> bit overkill there, kiddo. I just asked to get the mushrooms. Is that all you got? Buddy, we're supposed to be learning control. He doesn't get it. Uh, what do you think Arizona is like? A desert? Why? No reason. Just curious. Hello? Uh, think you can lift all those? I know I can. So pretty. It's like a wind. It's like leaves in a wind, but they're stones. Leaves in a wind. Whoa, Daniel. That's a. That's amazing. Come on. Find something else. Ah, precision. Quite important. Pick a rock. Any rock. Okay. And... Let's test your aiming system. Target in sight. Locked and loaded. Oh, I'm inside his head! No! It's so creepy! Oh, please make it stop! Oh no, no! Just throw it! Hello. Awesome! Okay, you're good. Now, let's spice things up a bit. Bring it on. Holy shit! That was not a fair fight. That's right. What's next? That was some next-level shit, Daniel. Thanks. I've been... training on my own sometimes. I know I haven't been around a lot lately. You didn't tell anyone, did you? No way! Why would I? Not even Finn? No! Jeez! You don't even trust me! Whatever. So lose lose with this kid. Oh, these are my options. These are the options of things I can say to my nine-year-old kid brother. Come on. Ugh, I hate this game. It's forcing me to argue with him, and I don't want to. This could be construed as construed as. Hey, bud, relax, okay? Everything's fine. I'm not mad. Or he could be 
just screaming at him to calm down, Daniel. This is why you're such a kid, stupid, blah, blah, blah. Or this could be like, hey, you seem to be going through something. What's wrong with you? Can we talk? Or it can be like, what is wrong with you? You're so stupid. Like both of these are, are just barreling towards a loss for me. I hate it. Ugh, I'll just go with the one that doesn't have cursing. What's wrong with you, man? I don't like this new emo Daniel. You keep throwing your attitude at me for no reason. Sick of it. Am I a bad big brother? Because I hang out with other people? You're always with them! That sucks. Oh, come on, Daniel. Bet you don't even want me around anymore. Don't say that. You know it's always you and me and I know. I mean, never mind. That's it, enough. You're being a brat. Can't say anything without you having a shit fit. We're family. We still have a long way to go. And we have to go together, right? I know it sucks. But you have to grow up now. Don't do it. He's gonna run away. Fuck. Daniel, stop it! Stop it, Daniel! No! Oh, you are though. Oh no. Oh no, this is not gonna go well. I got serious munchies. Any chips left? Dude, you scarfed the whole fucking bag. Have another hit. Yeah, yeah. I packed a fat ball. You're getting tired, babe. You shouldn't be. Had a long death to leg ducks. I took both roads everywhere Whoa. they went. You see that shit? It's a fucking UFO. I'm oh, serious, man. Look. They're finally coming to take you back! Tripped on a few words, but y'all are baked, so I'm good. <laughs> good job, sis. So beautiful. Damn, why you ain't rich and famous? <laughs> I mean, you can hook us up. That was cool, Cassidy. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. I take ass, cash, or grass. <laughs> the classic saying. <laughs> John, take a puff and pass it to your friend. Um, sure. Oh no! This choice oh, is gonna have consequences! Okay. No! I regret! I regret! I thought! No! Oh no! Daniel, no fucking way. 
how come you can? But That's I not can't? fair. They didn't show because Daniel being so. right next to me. They didn't show it. That is all for us. We must sleep. Ah. I hate this party, game. Oh. What is it? Like ten o'clock? <sighs> no worry, Finn. We'll party like rock stars tomorrow for our last night. Come on, one more round. Go sleep nuts. tight. Jeez. I swear every time you play that song, Cass, I see my poor black flag. Oh, man. I'm I just sorry. have Who's to remember. Black flag. It was my dog back in Colorado until last year. Yeah, something like that. A year ago, we were hopping a train, just me, Finn, and Cass, and black flag. We got caught stealing some shit in some random town. Motherfuckers called the cops on us. I had to run for it. He saw that train from afar and went straight at it. Cops right behind us. We barely made it. But nobody's able to get Black Flag. Jesus. Yeah, I see him chasing after the train, yapping at me. But I left him there. That's traumatic. Okay. End of story. I hope the cops picked him up. Got him a better home. I think about that damn dog every day. Here's to Black Flag. I, well, it's not Man, giving me the option to say anything. I miss Mushroom. That was our rescue dog. She didn't make it with us. Oh, sweetie. I just have to remember that- Jeez. Sorry, I ruined the mood. Don't worry, hands. We can do worse. Let's hear everybody's <laughs> worst. Memory, Excuse fair me. and square. Are you serious? Why the fuck not? We all need to say our piece once in a while. Who's up? Penny? Cool. Let's stop the violins. Check this out. Say hello to my little friend, Jinx. Met him dumpster diving in mm. New Mexico. It was cool. The boy had issues. Mood swings, delirious, self-harm, fun shit like that. You seem to get better with him. I think I loved him. Mm. Gave me this coin. Said he never gave his trust to no one before. We used to come here every now and then, hook up on cash, but he disappeared. A few miles north from here, in a pot farm just like this one. He went out one night, high as fuck, and zoom. That was the last time I saw him. Now I gotta hold on to this fucking penny just in case. Is that how you got your name? Yep. Whoa. Well, you must mean a lot to you. That sucks, brother. Shit like that happens around here. Plus, the guy needed medication. Sure did. I just hope he's okay. Maybe I'll run into his crazy ass someday. Who knows? It's a small world. I hand him back the trust that he gave me. All right. Bad vibes indeed. Can we do worse? Uh, Jake? Please? Well, just don't laugh. I guess my worst memory is when I lost my faith. Yeah, you mentioned it. What happened? I used to be a sheep. A true mm. believer. Mm. I was raised in Haven Point, Nevada. Small community. We have this amazing reverend. People line up to listen to her. She's intense. But for some reason, things happened to me and I started doubting myself. It kind of escalated. People said I was trouble. I couldn't get the answers I was looking for. Even from my own folks. I know the feeling. I felt so lost, wasn't sure what to believe anymore. So I left. I just needed to be alone for a while, you know? Find the truth by myself. I'm still looking for it. Jacob, my son, maybe we are the truth you were looking for. I'm glad I found you guys. I don't know if I'll ever go back there. Not until I get a signal from God, at least. I hope you can. Right, your family misses you a lot. I miss them too. Just not the other stuff. Family ties are a mess. Trust me. 
I know how that feels to be rejected. Thank you, Sean. What about you, Cassidy? Your turn. Uh, uh-uh. Pass. I already sang a song. <laughs> Figures. What about you, Sean? You obviously don't have to talk about that shit show back in Seattle. But if you have something else... Yeah. I've got a whole bag of these. Hannah did tell us Don't to open worry. up. We're all listening, man. Well, this is after me and Daniel took off from Seattle last year. We ended up at this redneck gas station in the middle of nowhere. But our pictures were on, like, every local newspaper. Fucking gutter press. So the owner shows up and knocks my ass out. He tied me up and called the cops. I hope you beat his racist ass to a pulp. Actually, Daniel did all the work. He got us out before the cops arrived. Oh, oh. that's my champ. Damn vigilantes. Yeah. Life is a bitch. We can only go with the flow. Like a river. Great metaphor. Great choice. I'm not dragging around any bad memories. Come on. Bull fucking Yeah, oh, you started this shit, bitch. Don't punk out now. Uh -huh. yeah, listen, smart asses. I'm just saying. You can't change the Look past. At that good dog. So you just gotta focus on what's next. Memories just are just lessons for Being the future. A good dog. The future, huh? What's your big plan, Prophet? Wanna know what my plan is? Picture this. A kick-ass beach house in Costa Rica. Sunshine, feet in the sand, sweet ocean view. We'd be one big, fucked up, happy, dysfunctional family. we just chill and, and sing and drink cocktails out of coconuts. Only thing we need is a little cash along the way. And then, boom. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. That's your dream? Beach house and coconuts? <laughs> oh, uh, too boring for you? This sounds like my folks' retirement plan to Florida. <laughs> I don't need anything else than what we already have. That's sure, sweet. we're working our asses right now, but we can beat it if we want. I'm not gonna settle down. No way. And that's how shit starts, you know? When you start having things of your own, things you ought to defend, property, land, family. What do you think you're missing out on now? Um, coconut cocktail? <laughs> uh, agree to disagree, fucker. Man, I'm too high for your shit. It's time to crash. And Penny goes down. Peace out, brother. Night, night. Looks like we still have some booze left. Who's in? <laughs> oh, twist my arm. I... Uh, Teeny tiny drink. And we need to talk about Sean's hippie hair. Boy needs a real haircut. You literally oh, have yes dreads. Yes, he does. <laughs> now it's your turn to get a trim. Karma. I'll call it a day, too. Night, everyone. Hey. I'm wiped out. Are you ready for bed yet? This is like not even an, a question for me. Yep. Yeah, I'm ready to crash too. Let's go. What? Daniel's no. like, you always hang out with them. And I'm like, I'll fall asleep. Well, and then you'll turn my ear on. Oh, get I out promise of here. to make night, night, more of an effort. See you in the morning. So here we are going to bed with Daniel. You didn't have to come with me, you know? I know. Hopefully, it'll negate that decision I made to smoke in front of hey, Daniel. Can we talk about what happened on the I'm lake? Sorry, Daniel. Yeah?
That was pretty wild when you lifted that... tree. I didn't know you could do such... things. Since... when did you... I didn't know either. I was just upset. It was the first time. Are you... losing control over your power? No way! I mean, it's just different now. I can feel it. Like, it's alive inside me. Strong. I just wish I could have a normal life again and stop being so angry all the time. I'm just so tired of all this crap. I feel the same way, dude. It's okay. Just. Oh, it's 2020 vibes for don't sure. Feed the beast, you know? Yeah. I'm just so angry all the time and I want things to go back you know, to normal. I still like it. But it's kind of tight on me now. Yeah. You're too big for it. I am. But I would like to hear about the Wolf Brothers, if that's okay. Just don't tell the others. Okay? Promise. All right. Get comfy. Where were we? Oh, yeah. The Wolf Brothers joined a pack of hounds that roamed all over. Finally, the brothers had found new friends. But the little wolf wasn't so sure about the new pack. He didn't want his brother to run away with them. And so the wolf would howl and prowl not knowing what was going on. But he didn't know that nothing could ever separate the Wolf Brothers from each other. Ever. Oh, please don't end up being foreshadowing. Please, 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 pretty please. Sean, move it now. Why did no one like wake him up? What This is such a huge tonal shift. I don't know what to make of this. I wake up late and everyone's waiting on me. I am not happy. I am very stressed out. So this is very strange to me. <laughs> like this seems like a very weird choice. Like a, you know, a 
another day, another dollar kind of montage, I guess. I, I cannot make heads or tails of that. <laughs> But all right. Okay. This is boring. So, everybody, tell me how you're gonna blow your next payday. The usual. Save it till the next one. <laughs> well, ain't we all stingy now? How about a keg offering for your family or... Or some hookers, or cocaine. Oh, please. There's a child here. Mm, I think he's heard worse. Besides, he's our mascot now. Oh, I want to buy a bacon burger and a pepperoni pizza. Then, a box of Choco Chris and, and a red slushie. Oh, hell yes. S screw the hookers. Bring on the Choco Chris. <laughs> Come on, Sean. You gotta treat yourself after all this hard work. I feel like it's weird and and very telling that she's like, oh, you're saving up, Mr. Stingy. Like, A, you don't have a right to his money. You make your own, and I assume make the same rate. And B, saving up is a very wise money decision. It means paying yourself later. <laughs> I don't know about this. Seriously, we have to save every dime, so... Hookers will wait. <laughs> Trust me, they will. So that's it, huh? You bust your ass all week for nothing? Some of us just got simple needs, princess. Yeah, like your beach house in Costa Rica? I wonder if the <laughs> D-A-N-C-E song matched up better if you chose okay. to hang out with them all night. Let's get this over and with. And party. Instead of ben, going to Cassidy, sleep with Daniel the night Sean, before. And, uh, you. Jake. Jake. Jacob. Poor Jacob. He's so awkward. Daniel, dude. Do you have to do this every week? Adults only. Oh, whatever. I work too. Yes, I know. But we have to keep a low profile. Got it? For the millionth time. Just wait here for a few minutes. And don't do anything. Nothing. I won't. I swear. Okay. We'll be right back. What? <sighs> what am I missing? For once, you're all on time. Let's see who wins that farm lotto. Jacob, right? I thought you wouldn't last a day, but you cleaned up. You're all right. Thank you. Thanks. Cassidy, your trims were pretty weak. And Big Joe told me you've been whining a lot. <sighs> Bet he did. Look, you can bitch all you want as long as you work. Otherwise, you're just taking up space. So get it together. I know, Meryl. Now for Sean. Very nice trims. Thank Good you. Good work, kid. Finn. I got over ten. That greenhouse. was my goal for I set for and myself. And our asses. That's why you keep coming back. You know it, boss. Uh, how about a raise? <clears throat> yeah. Sorry. Now for the moment you've all been waiting for. You what the fuck? Oh no. Me, oh jerk. no. Don't move. Now explain. That sneaky fucker, he was snooping around your living room. No, I wasn't. I was just bored, so I came in. Uh, shut up, Daniel. Seriously. Let Shh. him go. I told you. Come on, Meryl. He's a kid, not a thief. You want to frisk him? <sighs> Look at him. He's just following his big brother.
Your brother needs a lesson. You all need a lesson. So first off, no payday. Uh, oh, fuck that. Boss, no way. Uh, don't do that to us. We earned that money. Sean, you and your brother are, are fired. What? And don't come back or Big Joe will take care of your ass. Please, Meryl. That's bullshit, man. Man, I, I know you're pissed, but Sean is a good worker. Never brought you any losers, right? Sir. Quiet! Shut the fuck up. Sean, I warned you one too many times. We tried your way. Now it's my turn. Okay, Joseph. Just teach him a lesson. What pre tell does this lesson entail? Let me go! Come on, man. You beat that Big kid. Big Joe, what are you gonna do? He's just a little fucking kid! This ain't your business. Think I like it? It's mine. Yes! You're making a choice! Ow! What the... Okay. Okay, who did that? Who did that? Uh, Big Joe, my friend. <gasps> it didn't say it was timed. It didn't say it was a time decision. This game. Uh. Whoa. Well, that's it. Believe it or not, told you it would sound crazy. Fuck. That's mental. Exactly. I knew something was up with you guys. Damn, I would be scared shitless. I am. It's all going so fast, I'm fucking lost sometimes. It's okay, Sean. I know what I'm doing. Man. So, Sean, maybe this shit is in your DNA, too. Do you have a superpower? Nada. Zero. Nothing. Trust me. I tried. Really? When? Do you have any idea where it comes from? I mean, it can't be random. Doesn't matter anymore. He's got it, and I have to deal with it. Dude, I have to deal with it too. I mean we, but I'm the big bro here. So I have to make sure that you're safe. Damn, you're so unique, Daniel. That's why I need your word that you'll keep all this to yourself, seriously. Oh, this stays right with us. Promise, you can trust us. Jake? I, I feel know. like I don't I mean, trust Jake. This is a big deal, Sean. He's got How long can you keep this a religious secret? Uh, as long as brain we have to. It's and upbringing and I That's my job. Religious man. people don't do well with magic and stuff. Maybe it's our job to help him too. Guide him. What does he mean, Sean? Dude, no. Do not make this into some cosmic bullshit. You still can't tell anybody. Come on. I wouldn't do that to you, Sean. Or Daniel. Oh, this whole thing just blew my mind. I think I need a break. Is that okay? No worries. It's cool. Oh, not after what you guys went through with these bastards. Okay. Talk later. I'm concerned. He's right. It's fucking bullshit. I know. Finn, do you swear? I mean it. No worries, sweetheart. I'd never let anything happen to that little guy. <laughs> He's a true rebel. Thanks, man. For real. Rebel. Rebel heart. Oh, 
Hold up. You know, there's a lot of money around here. Oh no. What the fuck are you talking about? Meryl's safe. It's like a fucking ATM. I've seen it. Me too. In the back of the room. How you outlaws gonna get the combination? Me? No fucking way, Finn. Don't pull a kid into your stupid shit. Ugh. Getting a shitload of cash isn't stupid. We can get out of here. So you can be a beach bum? You're so selfish, man. <sighs> How? Sean and Daniel are out of work. They deserve this. And ripping Meryl off is the only way to do that? Really? And with a fucking kid? You know these assholes are armed, right? To I the guess teeth, they're armed. I didn't think about that. Yeah. And they always have oh, backup. <laughs> Don't lecture me. I was just having a brain fart. Why do you think all Let's these people go missing? Have a beer and forget about it, Sean. Cool? Deal. Not like I would let you use Daniel anyway. No more of this crap, okay? He just needs his ass kicked once in a while. I think you did. I can tell he was sorry. For him? Yeah. Damn. I'm gonna drink the crap out of this party. <laughs> so should you. Plus, since it's your last night, time for your tattoo. What? We're getting what? a tattoo? Are you getting a tattoo? <laughs> Dude, I'm Daniel right now. One. No, you don't, hipster. We have other things we gotta do. Listen, fugitive Sean. Okay. If you're getting a tattoo, you. Daniel's oh, getting a tattoo. Now there's three more people who know about your power. Don't worry. We can trust them. They said they won't tell. I know, but what if anyone gets scared and calls the cops? You don't know what can happen. I'm not scared of cops. I could stop them any time I want. Jeez, oh, oh, Daniel. Daniel. It's not... <sighs> At least... This will all be behind us once we reach Puerto Lobos. Who cares about Puerto Lobos? We'll talk later. I don't like this. See, I want Daniel and Sean to leave tonight. I want them to take their bags, okay. take their money, As and get out expecting. tonight because I don't like this Better attitude of Miller and Big Joe and their anger issues. I just don't like it. I want Sean and Daniel to get out. I have this fear that like, since they know where the camp is, they're gonna come get them in the middle of the night, take their money, and then they're gonna be poor with less than they started off with. I don't like it. <laughs> I hope we'll meet again. You taught me so much. Have a seat. <laughs> have a beer. To our last night together. No and beer. to your next Nope, Adventure. nope, nope, no, no. Do not be drunk when you need to be at your peak. Oh my gosh, no! Terrible. So, what are you gonna do next? <laughs> Figure out what I'm gonna do. Me and Daniel are homeless again. Well, <laughs> when I got out of jail, <laughs> I had nobody but me. My brothers were still in the joint. <laughs> they still are. I stayed with a friend. Nobody could find me. Yeah, then I just said, fuck it. And took off. <laughs> that was it, man. No more family. Just me. Always trying to find a new daddy. <laughs> or new bros. Yeah, stupid. I knew I had to cut everything off start over all for myself. That's what you're doing. Yeah, you're starting all over. And now, you just gotta take the next step to build a something for you and Daniel. 
right? Build what? Daniel's acting like such a punk. He doesn't want to listen to me. <laughs> I'm like a parent now. True. But he's still a kid. So, let him hit puberty. You can't stop it. <laughs> Just accept it. Yeah. Oh, he's gonna be all right, laddie. You uh, have enough cash for the trip? I doubt it, but we'll see. Hey, it's bullshit after all this. You deserve the lotto for life. Seriously. How are you two gonna get to Mexico? Hitchhike? Walk? Hey, just hear me out, man. There's only one way out of this for you. One way to hook yourself up. Don't you Listen, do it. You we need got to stop this, talking Sean. about this. Daniel can open that safe with his eyes closed. Come on. No, Meryl's probably wasted. Like every night. You guys can get to Puerto Lobos in style. With a, a nest egg. But you don't want Daniel to be homeless anymore, right? Huh? Then let's do this. I wouldn't let you in on this if I had any doubt. Here's my fear. If I say I can't, Ben is going to go directly to Daniel to convince him and it's going to be the two of them doing it anyway. But if I'm just like, okay, then I am walking into putting Daniel in physical danger. Can't with this game. So stressful. I can't, Finn. No way. Too dangerous for Daniel. Nah. nah. See, Daniel is the dangerous one. Nobody can even touch him. You know it. Hate it. I said no. I bet you're pissed at us because he didn't get paid. I would be too. I'm so sorry, but... Okay. Okay. No stress, man. I respect your decision. Just wanted to help you. And Daniel. Much love to you guys. Yeah. Sucks you have to go tomorrow. Makes me sad. <laughs> Gonna miss you, Sean. Truly. Thanks, Finn. Same here. I'm glad you and Daniel have each other. You two are special. You got powers. Don't take shit from anybody ever again. Go on. Get back to your party. I'm stoned. Gonna zen out. Damn, Finn. You need to land, man. I'd rather work my ass off for months than take that risk. Shit. Are we really getting kicked out of this place? We don't have enough money to go down to Mexico. Dude, what the dude. fuck are we supposed to do? Fuck him. You gotta think about yourself first, girl. I know, Shit. But... Cassidy's been busting my balls about a tattoo for so a week. So far. Looks like she meant it. Scary. No. Listen, not. I kind of feel it. Being so far from home. And with someone getting on her nerves half the time. Shit, I'm so tired of this. Hey. I'm hey, gonna miss her stupid down. good mood. You guys will be okay. Yeah. So different from the parties I had in Seattle. So different from the parties I had in Seattle. Hey guys, I feel good here. What's up? Oh yeah, Shana's in the house. Grab a brew, smoke a bowl. No I'm more. so good. Thanks, man. I'm, I'm already bust. <laughs> you fucking lightweight. That's what you get for keeping all the coffee to yourself. Messing with you, man. Hey, dudes. I am drunk. No shit. Okay, so, Anders. Yes. What's up? Hey, um, uh, I saw the Jinx posters by your tent. Are you 
Still looking for him? What were you looking over there for? Sorry, man. Because I'm a curious Didn't nosy mean to Nancy. Cry. I'm. It's fine. Yeah, I still carry these around. Drop them around when I can. You know, just in case. But no news so far. I'm sorry about that, Penny. Sad. We hear rumors about this place, but never think it was. Uh... That life we chose, though. Yeah, we'll meet again. <laughs> You're a badass motherfucker. I hope you do, man. I'm so pissed we have to bail tomorrow. Bullshit. Fuck Meryl. I can't figure this guy. Hates me, loves Finn. Kicks you out, crazy shit. Doesn't matter now. We're gone. No more job. I would rage if we did not get paid. Sean, this job ain't a thing. I can hook you up with another farm. Really? That would be fucking great. If you can. No worries. So, what's the next stop for you two travelers? I want to go north. Ingrid wants to go south. To both? Fuck that. I want to see Canada. She go to Tex's ass. Yeehaw. At least you have a choice. Still going down Mexico way? Yep. One way. Won't mind being in that heat, though. This is summer compared to Detroit. Summer. <laughs> I believe you. Okay. I'm done. More beer and weed for you. You leave it? Lightweight. We party for you, Sean. Talk later. And right there is where we're going to be ending today's episode. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for watching and for making sure I don't go through this entire horrible experience alone because life is strange always is with the sadness and the crying. Oh, but you love it though. You just gotta love that emotional catharsis and all of these beautiful moments as well. It's so like life. Anyways, please remember to like the video if you enjoyed it, share it with all your friends so they can enjoy it too, and of course, please remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell for Strange Rebel Gaming so you don't miss the next video. That's all. I love you all. Bye!